Thank you, Madam Vice President. We would like to thank Turkey for its constructive participation in the UPR, and we look forward to the implementation of the accepted recommendations. We would like to bring to the attention of this esteemed Council and of the delegation of Turkey that, in the past two years, 60 or more expatriate Protestant Christians in Turkey have been denied residency arbitrarily and without due process. For example, David Kandasami, a Sri Lankan national resident in Turkey for more than 20 years, received an entry ban. He is married to a Turkish Christian woman and has four children, all of whom are Turkish citizens. Andy and Catherine Hoard lived in Turkey for 30 years. Catherine received a sudden entry ban when flying back to Turkey from a short trip. She spent three days in det detention in a windowless immigration holding cell before being deported to the United Kingdom. These are just two cases out of at least 60 Protestant church members who have been banned from Turkey. Spouses, of, spouses have been separated from their families. Expats were denied access to their property and investments that had been previously carefully investigated by Turkish authorities and received their full approval. The authorities provided no explanation apart from telling these Christians that they, were, they constitute a threat to national security according to confidential government reports. Turkish authorities have denied the lawyers of these expats access to the confidential reports and therefore the authorities have offered no possibility for a fair and just appeal to review these orders in accordance with international law, namely Article 13 of the ICCPR. We call on Turkey to review its decisions to effectively expel and ban the 60 Protestant church members and to allow for a fair and just recourse against national security decisions and for the examination of the facts behind such decisions. Thank you.